Welcome to Ballroom Marfa's current exhibition on view, Donna Juanca Espejo Quemada. Her sculptures and paintings embody a physical and performative presence, and in these installations you're invited to pause and engage with your senses. The title translates to Burnt Mirror in English. Together, mirrors and fire, as the title suggests, can be catalysts for combustion and change. The sculpture on the inside is called Guerrera Protectora, which means warrior protector. The sculpture is very still, yet also has a lot of accoutrement that suggests movement and also refers to the body. They have pieces of long braids. I see hair as a suggestion of memory and recording devices, since it carries all of our DNA. From the beginning, you'll see a series of monochrome orange pieces that reference magma, and then we'll transition into a cool space of water and sky. I wanted to record the different landscapes that you encounter when you're driving in the desert and how the colors are shifting and changing as you continue onward into the different conditions of the weather. As you walk into the center gallery, you'll see traces and remnants of someone who has been in the space, someone who has rubbed, pressed, danced against the gallery walls. We'll never see this private performance, but the imprint of her movements are present. The body rubbings mark the movement of the performer, and it will impregnate the space even after the show is done and the walls are painted over. As one walks to the South Gallery, they'll encounter a dark and all blue environment. Here, the artist has created a womb-like space with a projected video work. Language for Huanca is also a material. Words are malleable and should be shaped as humans are always shifting and changing too. El está aquí. And finally, in Ballroom's courtyard, you'll encounter Donna Juanca's outdoor sculpture, which is her first ever. Here you'll see the circular steel sculpture, and the shape echoes its double inside in the indoor work. In the outdoor work, though, the surface is mirrored. It sits on top of a plinth constructed from adobe, which is a traditional building material of this region. Surrounding the sculpture is a geoglyph formed by white rocks, and it references Nazca lines, which are ancient Andean earth drawings. When you stand in the center of the exterior circles, you get the full vortex of sound. It is meant to be a meditative path that, as a viewer, you can walk through. Oh, 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 oh,